Puff was making them. <laughs> Oh, that was a fantastic set to watch. But he's playing Sheik. Oh, yeah, he said he was going to play his day two Sheik. Oh. I expect it to get bopped. All right, it's, he says it's good because it's day two. So to start off the game, we have Bad Sheik versus Good Sheik. And Bad Sheik didn't lead off the Shuriken, but now Bad Sheik. Ooh, Bad Sheik, such a fast fall. Very, uh, very vulnerable to those forward tilts. Shadow Sneak out of uh, combos. Yes. Takes away the hit stun of Yeah, Shadow Sneak is really good at stuff like that. What I really like is uh, how Orpheus is uh, using forward tilt to space him out. Yeah, most definitely. Ooh, I thought that was a misinput. Maybe he's just trying to cover himself. But yeah, he's using a lot of F tilt. You know, he doesn't have very many good aerials, or at least not that are fast. But, like, you see right there that forward are not safe on block. And there he goes with the F tilt. He's kind of having to poke, get a little damage where he can, but that forward smash almost going to take that first stock. Ziga proving that his uh, day two Sheik is, in fact, okay. Forward there, and that's going to be the DI mix up right there, taking the first stock. Yes, there is a bracket. You need to get that. Okay, and as we go here, ooh, tries to read an air dodge right there. Ziga using Sheik's pretty good aerial mobility to not fall onto that, even if he did air dodge, which I don't think he did. It's kind of hard to even punish Sheik's air dodge as well, because of just how the character is. Yeah, oh, <laughs> the, the grenade. That was wacky. Yeah, this is a super patient game that uh, Ziga's playing, and it makes sense because... Why approach when you don't have to? Forward throw pair, that was interesting. Oh, see, he, he almost just got a rabbit jab. That was weird. Oh, he fell off. Right, forward throw, is he going to see another up air? No, he went for the reverse air. Bear, that's interesting. Yeah, he's missing. He's dropping a lot of chic things, but, you know, I guess that's to be expected when you're first day chic. Tries to read an air dodge there. And he actually hit him with a second part of Vanish. Tries to hit him again with Vanish, and Orpheus is like, alright, you can't... Like, I'm not that free. Stop. Oh, but the very last hit there! Yo, I don't... I don't think he was ready for that. Yeah, that was silly. <laughs> I don't think... I don't know if that was on purpose, but... You know, we'll give it to him. 1-0. Ziga... Where do you think his ban is? Because don't they like the same stages since they're like the same character, only one's bad? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> oh. FD. FD is the pick. I want to see if Orpheus can get some footstool combos. Those are always hype. Uh, I, he hasn't been practicing them. So I but it's Greninja. I, I know. I, I tell him to practice them, but he, he just doesn't. Has he played with Dreisden at all? Uh, yes. He doesn't come out. Like, Orpheus only comes out here and... Oh, and Dristin always goes out to, like, Game Haven and other ones. Because so Dristin's got them down pretty well. Yeah, it's, it's really fun watching him uh, hit those on pieces. Yep, but Orpheus is going to play the more the more honest Greninja here. Using his super high jumps to go over the needles. Power? That was a well space scenario. That really was. A nair with the tiny hitbox, so he just still managed. Ooh, misses the ledge right there. Ziga with the nair punish. Which I guess could be worse. Ooh, she went for the soft nair and <laughs> Water Shuri can honestly probably put him in a better decision. He he didn't have to up beam. Orpheus can ma can really establish stage control. Ooh. I like that uh tick forward smash right there. That jab one to force either an air dodge or a spot dodge and just something that people would try to get out of the combo with. Yeah, two hundred percent for that now. Rabbit jabs. Orpheus brought this game back pretty hard. He's a uh, could be an up throw, up air percent here. Ziga. Yeah, it sucks out so much as nipple ledge. Eek. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Please, yes. You'll still make a ledge, even if you air dodge, he's not gonna punish you for it. 
Zio, why are you doing this? <laughs> Ziga said, oh, that down air to, to stop. I asked Ziga why he's doing it, and he said, if he can't stop it, I'm going to keep doing it. Which is a fair point. You know, you never know, you can, like, hardly see Greninja. Like, you can see the white parts in his tongue. Ooh, good air dodge read right there. Missed the sweet spot, though. So, unfortunately, not able to kill. Sheik lives on. I want to see him try to use some, get some Hydro Pump shenanigans. And that falling forward air is going to do it. I think it's the mic. Because I hear myself like that too. Genma. But one thing I uh, I noticed before is that Ziga <laughs> can't do sheet combos for one. But also he's just kind of playing super patient and only reacting to what Orpheus is doing. And Orpheus is, doesn't have an answer at this point. Like that, Ziga whiffs the Nair, but because of Orpheus' neutral getup, he didn't throw out an option fast enough, so he still got hit by the forward tilt. He went for down tilt. I'm not sure if he just missed the up smash or... Oh, there he goes! He gets the read! And that... That's ever almost killed. Rage is a silly thing. And forward throw into up air. Is that not going to take the stock edge? Can't forget we are still talking about Cheek here. Okay, the forward tilt's got some range. Oh yeah, yeah, like, in, like either a neutral or a roll away or... Yeah, Sheik is probably in forward air kill percent right here. We see him throwing it out a lot. Up throw... I know up throw up air is a... is a 50-50 on like Bayonetta. I don't know exactly how which character is determined who that is a 50-50 on, but it doesn't look like it is on Greninja. Went for it right there. Did not kill just yet. And gosh, this one kind of boring. <laughs> we're going to see Ziga. I, I get to you. There's the forward tilt right there. I thought we were going to see Ziga Needle Camp. But a forward tilt is going to connect. And that is going to be a 2-0 for Ziga's very, very good. Very, very good day two chic. All right. I got to go play a match. Thanks, y'all. Okay, can I have Bob Ross and Dr. Kudahe? And then could I have Da Vinci and Spoinkman? Can I have uh, Flo and Zephyr on stream? Flo